rough weather moves in, but we push through to get a little more progress on the pallet shed. This is Desert Homestead Prepping. Make sure to like and subscribe and hit that bell for notifications. Really kind of feeling the crunch on time here before the coldness of winter really sets in where we're at. With everything going on in the world, you know, it's it just feels like every aspect of our lives is is in danger, you know, worrying about um, the uncertainty of our, you know, of our income, the uncertainty at work with, uh, you know, kind of a forced choice that we have to make. And, you know, so far I haven't heard much at my employer of one way or the other, but we've heard of many other people who have had to make the decision not to comply with certain uh, requirements, which is pretty frightening. Um, that's really the big reason why we have been working on this place. I mean, long ago, we just knew that something was coming. Um, of course, I, I never anticipated that it would unfold like this. I mean, five years ago, who could have anticipated that we would have been through what we've all gone through over the last year and a half? Um, but yeah, with so many other things going on with the breakdown of the supply chain, um, things are getting more difficult to acquire, more expensive. Um, you know, we're just praising God that we have so much out here already. I mean, when it, when it comes to being prepared and, and having the supplies, that we would like to have. I mean, it, it feels like we, you can never have enough. I mean, how much food in storage is going to be sufficient for the rest of your life? I mean, obviously it's never gonna be enough. How much medicine can you have stored away that's gonna be enough? How much wood can you have stored away? I mean, how much firewood? I mean, and the list just goes on and on. Um, I'm just so very grateful for us that we don't have to live in anxiety. I mean, I, I trust in the sovereignty of God and that He has a purpose in all things for my life and for my family. And, you know, whatever is to come, I know that my time and our time is limited in this world and that our hope is in the life to come and that, you know, the price has been paid by our Lord and Savior, Jesus Christ. And so in the meantime, yes, I have a responsibility to take care of my family and to do what I can to provide a place of refuge. But uh, when it comes down to it, I know that, you know, our God is more powerful than all the forces in this world. And we can trust him that there's a purpose in all these things. So, in the midst of that, yes, I have this balance um, of trusting in God. I don't have to live in anxiety, but at the same time, I do have to be serious about being prepared and taking responsibility to get things in order out here. So, I'm taking that responsibility serious, and you know what, with that, I'm going to push forward on this project. So, there's a uh, there's some storms coming in. I mean, it's, it's October 11th right now. So it may seem like it's, you know, the middle of fall, but out here, it's supposed to hit, out here it's supposed to drop down to like 20 degrees overnight for the next couple nights. And it's supposed to, be freezing rain and snow and it's going to be pretty miserable but you know what I'm just going to push through it I'm going to do the best I can and um, I can't really waste the 
the precious days that I have taken for vacation from work. So with that said, I'm going to get after this and, you know, it, it'll be kind of slow. Um, had to take the boys back into town because of our custody issues. And so it's just me and, and the girls out here. So I'll pretty much be on this by myself. It won't, it won't go as fast as I would like, but either way, I'll be able to push and, and get as much done as I can. Okay, so this is how far I've gotten so far. Uh, my wonderful wife <laughs> set up some plywood right here to try and block the wind for me. Uh, it's working okay. So, got the framing above the door done, got the window framed in, and it's getting close to lunchtime, and it is just starting to snow quite a bit. It is coming down pretty good right now. I don't know how long it's going to last, but at least it's not rain. I'd rather it snow than rain, to tell you the truth. So I'm going to keep on going until I'm called in for lunch and then after lunch we'll just keep on plugging away. Some days it feels like progress just moves really slow, but we just keep plugging away. Thanks for joining us. Wish you guys all the best. Uh, keep us in your prayers. Don't let anxiety take hold of you. Just keep moving on, doing the best you can.